Hi everyone, welcome to Craft Anonymous. My name is Liz and I just want to say thank you for joining me on today's program. Um, before we start, I just want to let you know that today we're going to do something really fun. We are going to be working with our cute glass that I got from Dollar Tree, which is just a dollar. And I just want to let you know that you can get this at any Dollar Tree around your houses, around your stores. You know, it's really something that you can just walk into a store and boom, it's there. Okay? And also to make this happen today, we're going to make this uh, cup with glitters, alright? This cup is going to include all these cute gl um, glitters that I have here. Um, also, in order to apply your glitters the way that you want it, you know, you're going to need a brush. Definitely going to need a brush or, you know, like the kind that I got here. And also, we can always use with whatever kind of glue that you have around the house. Either the white glue or the clear glue, okay? Um, also, on today, this is going to be my flower. Isn't it so cute? So cute. Yes. All right, and before we start, I want to let you know that all these ingredients that I have here is what you need to make this glass come to life, okay? This glass is going to be coming back to life in a few minutes, okay? All righty. All right, now I'm going to glop my glue. Um, I'm going to, you know, put some on a piece of paper. And after I do that, um, I'm going to have my glitters to it just to make sure that um i get the image that i pictured in my head <laughs> the way i want it to look all right so far we're still gonna need to put some more glitters to it because it's not the way i want it to look uh, the more glitter the better oops the more glitters you have the better so you know it's just like painting the house but not really you have to mix your um, glue with the glitters, okay? And I'm gonna try and see if this is the consistency that I wanted. All right, I'm gonna grab my glass, okay? And after which I'm gonna measure to see how tall I want it to be, all right? So I want it to be somewhere around here, okay? I'm gonna trace that. All right, can you guys see that? I'm gonna trace that. And also, just, you know, trace it down with the glue. All right, it's okay if what you mix is not enough. You can always add some more. And we're gonna wait for this to dry as well. You don't wanna just, oh, I don't, it doesn't look the way I wanted it to look. You have to wait for everything to turn out beautiful. I mean, it might take a couple of hours. It might even take, you know, a day, but it's fine. That's good. That's why you're doing this at home. So that you can take your time with it. You don't have to rush it, okay? And also, you see that the glass has some glitters on it already. Alright, now that I have these glitters, I kind of got two kind of glitters, okay? I got the really shiny one. It has, you know, a little bit of volume to it. And I have this really fine glitters that looks like sand. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to try to sprinkle the glitters onto the cup. Can you see that? Can you see it? It's changing. We're bringing it to life. And the ones that we have, we don't want to waste everything. <laughs> so, and also to keep your station really clean, 
you can always use papers you know towels from the kitchen and yeah it's gonna save you a lot of time cleaning after you finish making your vest can you see that can you see that boom and i'm gonna add some more on this side you know just to give it a little bit of more glitter glitter makes everything better you guys can you just see how the cups it came to life <laughs> I, I love it i'm so proud of myself you guys he brought it to life so now we're gonna let it sit and dry before we do anything to it okay you're gonna wait for it to dry and while we're waiting for it to dry i just want to show you that um you can always put your flowers in it to put it in your you know in your dining table in your bathroom you can decide to put your cotton balls in there you know whatever it is that you feel like oh this is gonna look cute and you can always do that with it so i'm gonna come back to let you guys see what it looks like when it's dry but this is exactly what it's gonna look like when it is dry the glitter is gonna be so cute you guys it is i'm so happy it turned out as great as i wanted it to be as a matter of fact it turned out better and I just want to say, yeah, you should try this out at home on the day of. Even if it's just something fun that you want to try out, you should definitely try to do this. And it's just going to be a couple of minutes, not even going to take hours. But a drawing might take a little bit, okay? All right. Thank you so much for joining us today on our, um, Crafters Anonymous. Once again, I'm Liz. You have a wonderful rest of your day.